Hello, Cancer. It's my lady, and this is my lady's way tarot. And I'm coming to do your weekly express. Nope, weekly night. Not. <laughs> mm, okay. Calm down. Slow down. Relax. <laughs> okay. Weekly night. I still can't do it. Lightning reading. Lightning weekend reading for the weekend of. September 15th through the 18th, 2023, or in the week of that, 2023. The cards I'm using today are Tarot de la Nu by Alexandra Bach and Carol Ann Eschenazi. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, setting up personal readings, commenting, and hitting that notification bell. All right, more foes. Let's get this show on the road all right what's going on with the cancer what's going on what's going on what's going on cancer 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 devil all right so we could be dealing with capricorn but we could be dealing with some kind of obsessions addictions mental physical emotional um abuse okay yep negative energy so we got the knight of swords here somebody is always looking for something wrong okay some reason to go off or on someone some reason to cuss somebody out all right, so we got the Empress card here. So I do feel like somebody was waiting for some kind of new... Uh, no, it's a new person. New person, excitement, new adventure, okay? But I feel like with this excitement and new adventure, this person is very aggressive. Um, This person is very pokey, okay? Nagging, okay? It's just like, oh, well, eat your sushi, okay? You got to use chopsticks. Like, I don't want to use chopsticks. So, it's like this person is always trying to control. Okay. Definitely too controlling here. Let's keep going. Did I cut the cards? What's going on? I think I did. So, we ain't going to do that. Nope. It wants me to. So, that's what I'm going to do. We're going to do it again. We're going to do it again. Wow, okay, the energy was definitely stronger. So I'm going to just get the bottom card because I um, usually look at that one and I'm going to get the top card. All right, so we got the Six of Swords here. So I do feel like some kind of travel may be getting ready to happen. But also, to me, this card represents the storm, the calm before the storm, okay? So it looked like that right now somebody's having a lot of fun. We're doing all this crazy, exciting stuff, okay? Um, but this person is being a little bit naggy, okay? So judging by these cards, this is just the beginning, okay? So new person, uh, I do feel like it's going to be fun. This person spending all this time, spending all this money. But this person wants to control everything, and it's going to get worse. Seven of Swords is going to pop out the who this person is. We got Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Energy, Strong here. Aries energy with this uh, Empress here. But this Seven of Swords, um, I do feel like this person is getting ready to, you know, sneak out and be their, their self, who they really are. And that's a very controlling, um, obsessed, demanding person. So it's showing me that Capricorn card again, the uh, Devil card. And I do feel like this person has uh, addictions as well, okay? And I do feel like this person can get physical as well, okay? And I feel like that's because... I'm not doing what this person wants me to do, how they want me to do it. All right, so we got these cards. They flew out. Then we're going to see what's at the bottom of the deck right here. I'm going to put that there so I can remember. So we got the Ace of Pentacles. Assets coming to you. I saw an owl in her head. Anybody see an owl? Okay, so I don't know what that means, but I kind of sort of want to look it up, but maybe if one of y'all can look it up <laughs> yeah, or maybe i'll look it up later there and type some stuff in but um when i think of aisle owls i think of you know somebody that's always watching i do feel like with some wisdom is going on so i do feel like somebody knows what's going on but i do feel like somebody's trying to enjoy all this stuff as well okay um but i also feel like 
somebody could be watching you going through this and they're getting ready to tell you okay there's a train coming this person is getting ready to get crazy but you need to watch out what's going on all right so this told me to sideline this this is a whole sideline energy so i gotta keep going for this okay all right, so we got the new beginning card. So we got the new beginning card. This person is going to be trying to buy you all kinds of stuff. Um, but, of course, one thing to look at is if they buy you all this kind of stuff, but it's in their name, okay? That's the mark of the controller, okay? So if they don't want you to have anything in your name and they want to buy you all this nice stuff, that's because they want to put their hooks in you. They're going to try to get you to sell all your stuff, and then you're going to be following them around to um just keep the things that they bought you that's actually there so just look out for that so the day La new card definitely new beginnings new starts i do feel like i have all these things but i'm not happy inside so definitely not gonna be happy with this person okay so we got the ten of cups here so i do feel like oh this right here makes me feel like the family is looking at this stuff the family is like oh well this is nice and I like this and you know they thinking about the stuff that they can get so they don't care about your unhappiness they just like oh I can have this I can have that you know so they using you they basically pimping you out okay excuse my words but that's what it looked like all right so we got the queen of wands here so this makes me feel like somebody is extremely emotional about this situation I care about my family I care about my stuff and uh, myself and I just want to know what to do okay so that's not everybody but that's definitely some people so let's keep going with the regular reading okay all right so we got the wheel of fortune here so I do feel like I, all of a sudden so it looked like things were not going well for me okay um i do feel like um when it comes to monetary gain monetary things assets you know i feel like i wasn't getting what i deserved there i do feel like this new person coming in they helped me to achieve that uh but i also feel like you know they're digging at me emotionally and mentally but I'm not seeing that. I'm just seeing like, oh, I'm getting all this stuff I like. I'm going on all these vacations and stuff. I don't have to worry about money. Okay, but emotionally, you're going down. Oh, you, oh goodness. Whew. All right, so we got the world card here. Yeah, so it looked like somebody's going on a lot of trips. Somebody's doing a lot of moving and vacationing. I do feel like somebody's just having the time of their life. But with this six of, of swords here, that's the calm before the storm. So everything is okay and all beautiful now. But do not let this person strip you of everything that you've built yourself, okay? This person is trying to get into the position of control. And then they're going to take everything they can from you and try to use that to control you and it's very easy to get in this situation but very very hard to get out okay oh that's why when i left a person like this i left with a couple of tiles and a couple of forks nothing else was in my name that's what's happening here okay don't don't let them fool you this is what it's all about we got the ten of pentacles here so i do feel like somebody's in this situation for money stability when it comes to money but i do feel like somebody's losing a chunk of they they mind every every week dealing with this person all right but i don't know <sighs> i don't know what what is it worth that's all i got to say and that's all i have for you guys make sure to check your sun moon and rising signs thanks for watching